Hey, 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 my crafty peeps. Tis I, Randy Strand. And I am here today to do a double unboxing. I am so excited. So Diamond Art Club had their big anniversary extravaganza. And when my husband asked me what I wanted for Mother's Day, I was like, hello. So I got all four of my Diamond Art Club paintings in today. I figured I would do two separate videos. I'll do two and then two in the next video. But I know you've already seen them unboxed, but you know how much I love anything that comes from the ocean. So look at this, What Lies Beneath by Dakota Datweiler. I was so excited to see this painting when they came out with it. I think that's incredible. It is a 70 centimeter by 88 centimeter and it is a square. It is either an octopus or a squid or a kraken, something like that. And then you can see there's a gigantic lionfish over here. So I'm gonna unbox this one first. And then next, I love me some Simona Candini. We have Tea Party by Simona Candini. It is also a square and it's a big one. It's a 93 centimeter by 70 centimeter. So without further ado, let's get into this one. So I hope you guys are doing good. I hope that you were able to get some paintings from the um, sale as well. I want to thank Diamond Art Club um, for the discount code and all of the beautiful paintings that they came out with. <clears throat> Excuse me. Let's grab this stuff here and we can look at it. Looks like I got a new toolkit. That's exciting. We have our sticker here. You can put this on the side of the box. You can put it in a log book. If you um, log the different paintings that you do, if you have like a little notebook, we have our toolkit. Now, if you have never diamond painted before, this will have everything in it that you need. This will have um, square tweezers because it is, I mean, tweezers because it is a square. So you get some nice pointy tweezers there, some pink tweezers, and they are branded Diamond Art Club. Got a green sparkly pen, some washi tape, that's pretty. And we've got a squishy to go on our pen. It looks like the cover minder is a little macaron. So it's like half of a macaron there. And then we have two multi-placers. This one right here, is that a six or a seven? It's a seven and then we have a four and they're skinny multi-placers. You've got this cute little tray that's got glitter in it and you've got a little stopper for your spout got some baggies and you've got a little container with um, a heart-shaped wax in it. So that is everything that you would possibly need to diamond paint other than your diamond painting. So that is the toolkit. Let's get into this. I just was so excited to see this painting and I honestly Y'all know that I love anything from the sea, but I was very surprised to see that this was one of the ones that sold out first and that so many people wanted it. I, I just, I don't know why. I was very surprised. So these are poured glue. So if it's, uh, it will self flatten, but if you want to get the wrinkles out quickly, you can roll it back on itself. Oh, I can't wait to see this one. Let's put this over here for a second. Here's our big old thing of drills. They always include this. Thank you for your purchase. It tells you some tips and tricks about diamond painting, what's included in the kit. You've got some social media stuff here. There are your step-by-step -step instructions. And then um, on the back, they have an app and oh, look at that, 20% off your first purchase through the app. I also have a discount code below that you can use if you would like to purchase and you never have before. Now here is the big sticker sheet. So you've got the title of the painting, What Lies Beneath, you have the artist, your start date, end date, and then basically the same information that was on the front of the box. There is the picture again. That is so amazing. 
And here are the stickers that go on your containers. Um, we have 51 colors. And then we have, ooh, we've got five ABs. And I love that they put them in order too. One, two, three, four, five. That's awesome. They match with the, the symbol, the number that's on there. Anything that's below a 150 is going to be a Diamond Art Club AB. They are special drills. We will look at those in a few minutes when we check out the drills. Look at this big old pack of drills. That's awesome. A lot of blues in there. Ooh, I see some of the ABs. Yes. Okay. Let's flip this puppy over and take a look at it. I think I got it the right way here. Oh man, let me back you out. This is amazing. This is amazing. Wow, wow, wow. This is incredible. It is so cool. I love it. I love it, I love it. Please excuse me if you see me in the, the shot here. I'm a mess today. Um, wow. So <laughs> at the top of the canvas, it says, do what makes you sparkle and I'm an art club. Over here, as uh, per usual, they've got the legend or schematic, whatever you want to call it, up here in the top left corner, as well as in the bottom right corner. Down here, you've got the thumbnail and you've got the same information that was on the front of the box. Here you have a 10% off gift code and you've got their social media. Look at this canvas, I love it. So you've got all these huge bubbles that are coming up. You've got the gigantic octopus or kraken or squid, whatever you wanna call it. And then you've got a huge lionfish over there. That's so neat. There's an iceberg, you've got the boat up here and the clouds and the waves and oh man. This is a spectacular painting, I have to tell you. I am feeling very, very lucky that I got this one. And um, I can't wait to see where the ABs go. I, I have a feeling that at the top of a lot of these bubbles, I can see a lot of fives in there. You're gonna have a lot of those white ABs, those 141s. So anyways, before we get into this too much, let me flip it over oh well you know what let's before i flip it over and look at the drills let's get a little closer here and look at the drill field crystal clear per usual let's go up here yeah i think it looks really good let's move to a different location look at some different colors here so far, I'm not seeing anything, you know, that looks identical right next to one another, which is good. Let's look at the, the lionfish over here. Yeah, everything looks really good. Let's check the sticky, too, while we're at it. Ah, oh, yes. Very sticky, very sticky. All right, guys, I'm going to flip it over. And I will bring you down. We check out this big old thing of drills. Right, this is awesome. So basically, if you store the drills separately from the canvas, I know some people hang their canvases up. This says what lies beneath, so you know that it is that goes to this canvas. Also, it's got this number up here. It looks like the four is a little faded off of there or something. But this will be on the front of the painting too, so you can match that as well. All right, let's get in to the drills. Got a lot of them. And if you don't like the crinkle, what's wrong with you? Okay. Man, look at all these. Oh man, these are so pretty. Ooh, I see some really nice looking ABs too. Let's grab this one first because it looks like it has the bigger packets. Ooh, we're gonna have a lot of seven, nine, six in here. Okay, so let's start out. We have one, two, three, four bags of 310. So that's not terrible. And while we're looking at these, let's look, you know, I know we keep saying it, but Diamond Art Club is manufacturing their own drills now. And let's look at these black ones and see. Yeah, they look good. I like that they're nice and flat on the back. 
I've said it once and I'll say it again. You never know until you lay them down how they're gonna be, but uh, those look really good. So you've got your three tens. We have a bag of 834. We have one, two, three, four bags of 820. We've got three bags of 995, which is okay with me because I love that color. And we've got one, two, three, four, five, six bags of 796. So you've got a lot of that blue, but that's a really pretty color too. And then bam, we've got our first AB and we get two big old bags. Um, we know Diamond Art Club loves their 141. So you've got that beautiful white AB. AB, say it with me, stands for Aurora Borealis. Basically, that just means it has this special coating on it that uh, shines in the light. It's beautiful. It uh, reflects the colors around it and really makes it stand out. So you can see that it, it reflects different colors. It's like a little rainbow in there. So that is gonna be our first AB. Let's see here. The next set that we have, we've got 209, which is a small bag. We've got some 414, 890, 415, 550. We've got some 3855, 3012. We've got a bag of 799, 3325. We've got two bags of 3811. We've got two bags of 3756. We've got a bag of 3841, and we have two bags of 3843. 833, two bags of 775, and oh, one more bag of 310 on there. So what did I say, what does that make? Five bags of 310? That's still not bad. All right, here are some smaller bags, the smallest ones, I think. We've got, oh, here's our other AB, 134. And as you can see, it's a green, kind of a olive green, I guess. And it's got quite a bit of a, a goldy reflection to it. So that's pretty. We've got a small bag of 728, 701, 869, 938. 935, we've got 413, 992, 699, that's a pretty green, 838, we've got 3828, 420, 3051, 3760, 993, 3371, 3011, 327, 312, and 154. All right. So let us look at our last bag here. Ooh, yeah, I see, that's that AB I was looking at earlier. All right, flip this this way, sorry, sorry. So we have 3814, and this is a square, but there are a couple of rounds in here. That's, I find that interesting. Yeah, there are a couple of rounds. All right, our next AB is 119, and it's a beautiful purple AB. That's really nice. You can see all the sparkle on there. We've got 318, 3755. Ooh, this is an, an interesting AB. I don't know that I've ever seen this color before. This is 140. That's really nice. I like that a lot too. Look how pretty that is. Diamond Art Club has great ABs. They've got really good coating on there. I think that looks nice. We've got a little bag of 336. We've got two bags of 598. Ooh, this is what I was looking at before. 120. Two nice size bags of 120. As you can see, oh, there's a bunch of coating on the back of there and there's a little odd piece, but it's all good. It's all good. Look at those ABs, you guys. So pretty. So pretty. And then we've got two bags of 996. And we have one, two, three, four, five bags of 823. And that is also a very dark blue. So those are going to be your drills. Let's back you out again, and I will show you where the ABs go. All right, here we are. So basically, number one is 119, and that is the beautiful purple color. It's almost, 
I don't know. It's not as dark as 550, but it's, it's a beautiful purple. So basically these are going to go, um, they're, they're not completely covering down in the rocks here, but you've got a section right through here, a couple down here through this section and right through here. So you've got just a couple of those in this area on the rocks the, at the very bottom. There are not any over here. They're just over in this section a little bit, all right? And then number two, we have that blue, which is 120. So you get two bags of this, all right? All right, so you've got number two. Number two is going to be anywhere you see this icy blue color. I mean, there's there's a lot of that blue under the water. Um, let's see, and I don't see any more over there. Let's look on this side. You've got some shooting through here and a little bit in this bubble. Let's see and through this bubble. Oh yeah, you do have a little in there. So they're throughout the bubbles as well, like right in here. Um, I don't see any in that bubble. There are a couple up here, and then also just kind of sprinkled throughout in this area. All right, that's where your twos are gonna be, those blue colors. Number three is is there a hole in my, must be a hole in one of my baggies. Okay. Number three is going to be 134 and it is that dark green color. The only place I could find number three was up here on the island where you see kind of those light areas right through here. That's gonna be where you have the number three because you don't have a ton of those. It's a small bag. Number four, is going to be 140. And that's this beautiful color. Okay, so let's see where number four is. We have, I think number four, because it's only a small bag as well, was up in the iceberg. Yes, so you've got some little sections right through here of number four. So that's the only place that you're gonna have um, that color for the iceberg, the bottom part of the iceberg. And then last but definitely not least, number five is the large quantity of number 141 ABs. And let me tell you guys, they do not disappoint with this one. They are everywhere. I mean, every single bubble at the top of the bubble or throughout the bubble, You've got um, the number five, the white ABs. You have a bunch of little, like mini bubbles that are coming up over here. Those are all fives. You've got some in here that are like smaller bubbles. Those are all fives. You've got some down here in the bubbles. You've got some down here in the bottom. Um, let's see. All of the, the inner part of the tentacle here is all number fives. And through most of the suction cups, you've got fives. Anywhere that you see that white color, you got a bunch of them through here, through here. I mean, they really give you a good amount of ABs. Let me bring this down a little bit too. Up here in the lionfish, they're all throughout um, where are they? Over here. They're all throughout that section, right through here, right through here. So you've got a little bit going this direction and then down here and then up in the top. You've got a bunch of those as well. Let's see. All of these through here are number fives. I mean like this whole section all through here. You've got fives going down through the, the bottom part of the boat. You've got fives up in here. Um, yeah, I, I think Time and Art Club did a fantastic job with AB placement here because you've really got it all over. You've got a bunch down here at the water line where it breaks at the top. You've got a bunch through here in this section. You've got a couple over here and then 
where you see all those little white dots across the top, those are all white ABs. So once again, this is What Lies Beneath. Um, tell me what you guys think about this one. Like I said, I was super surprised how many people wanted this one. I don't know. I knew it was up my alley. You know, I grow corals and I love to, um, it's been a long time, but I love to snorkel. I mean, anything that has to do with underwater. So I just was completely smitten with this one. This is the first one that I knew I absolutely had to have, but I uh, was very surprised how popular it was. I'm glad it was because that way Diamond Art Club will hopefully get the idea and start putting out more paintings like this. So I will wrap this sucker up and we will open the next painting. All right, guys, I got that one all packed up. So here we are back at Tea Party by Simona Candini. I really like her artwork, and she has come out with some really cute stuff, guys. Really cute newer stuff. If you don't follow Simona on uh, Instagram, you totally should, because she's got some really, really cute new art that's come out, and I hope that Diamond Art Club will... Um, make them, create them. So here is the small sticker. Um, we won't be th go through the whole toolkit, but because it's a new one, I'm just curious what the cover minder and washi tape that's in here looks like. Yep, pink tweezers. And, oh, that's pretty. That's really pretty. So here's my sparkly cover minder. This has got some of that silver stuff stuck on the back. That's pretty. And then here is, you know, let me some lime green. So here is the washi tape. It's kind of a pretty yellowy lime green color. I like that. All right. So that is the tool kit. And then let's get into this guy. Now this one, you thought that the um, octopus was big, but this one is even larger, 93 centimeters. Man, that's, um, but you know, uh, Simona Candini also did Ms. Havisham, and I did that canvas, and I loved it, and it was a bigger canvas, too. I can't remember exactly what the measurements on that one was, but, um, man, yeah, this is a big one. But uh, I know it was large as well. And this is a square. I think I mentioned that earlier. Just rolling it back on itself here real quick. And they are, I think I did mention too, they're self-flattening canvases. Um, but rolling them back because they're poured glue just flattens them quicker. So... Here is the picture again. You can see we've got the Queen of Hearts over here and the little mouse. And we've got Alice, Cheshire Cat. I mean, everybody's in the picture. So there you have it. This one has 61 colors and once again, we have five ABs. That's nice. I think for larger paintings and especially like the um, What Lies Beneath, I thought it was really cool that they had um, so many ABs and they were spread out so much. Looks like we're going to have a good bit of 310s. We get some big old 310 bags here. So let's roll this out and then we shall look at the canvas and the drills. Oh man, that's awesome. That's awesome. What a cool canvas. That is really nice. I like that a lot. Um, Simona Candini does a lot. If you look at the paintings that Diamond Art Club does, um, creates of hers or recreates of hers, most of them are Alice in Wonderland. And it's funny, I wouldn't consider myself to be a huge Alice in Wonderland fan, but the paintings that she does are so fabulous. You can see the white rabbits back there with his little, his little clock. I'm late, I'm late for a very important date. So yeah. I think this looks really neat, and although they include the ABs, um, I can definitely see some places, you know, her wand and, and her crown and things like that where I will put some special drills. So, let's check our sticky. Now, I, 
I have noticed something newer with Diamond Art Club is they're putting this plastic all the way out to the edge, which is kind of a newer thing. I don't know why they're doing that, but I've just noticed they're really covering up the entire canvas, whereas it used to be a little bit shorter. So I don't know what that's about, but you know, it doesn't bother me. That's nice and sticky. Let's get up in the business. If I can get that to focus, there we go. Looks very good. Let's go up here to a different section. Where the Queen of Hearts is. Yeah, I mean, very clear once again. I don't see any problems. Nice, nice. All right, let's lay this this way. Get our drills and get down into it. All right, let's see what we've got in here. We've got a bunch of good colors in here. There are a lot of dark. Seems like there's a lot of gray and brown. We've got some black down here. So yeah, let's get into this. And once again, you can see that it's got the number that's on the canvas here and it says tea party so you know that these drills would go with this canvas if you so choose to separate them once again sorry if you don't like the crinkle and if you don't like it what's wrong with you all right Got some big old packs here um, let's see. Let's start with the one that's got the three tins. This is, these are the larger bags. All right, so we've got four bags of $37.99, which is a gray color. We've got two bags of $38.61. We've got $38.64. We've got one, two bags of $9.34, $4.52, $9.35, $9.45, Thirty-three seventy-one. There's three bags of that, and for three ten, we've got one, two, three, four, five bags of three ten. Unless, of course, there are any more hiding in here. I think that's it because I think those are nine thirty-nine. Yep. All right. So that is all of the three ten. Sorry. Let me get this untangled. All right. Here's our first A B. So this one, the 134, is that green that we had in the um, octopus, the What Lies Beneath canvas. So that's the same green. Then we've got 498, 3772, 993, 780, 3064, 3834. We get some 647, 841, 154, two bags of 3860. Two bags of 992, 814, 898, 3814, and we have three bags of 939. And our last set of larger bags. Oh, we've got a couple of small bags in this one. Oh, we've got our first AB. This is interesting. This I haven't seen before. 106. It almost looks like a cream colored. A, B. So that's not the, the white like 141. This is sort of a, an off-white color. And then we've got 350. We've got 318, 754, 3865, 414, 758, 433, 782, 646, 422. We've got another A, B, which is 109. And it's almost like a... I don't know. I don't want to say khaki because it's not that green, but it's kind of a, might be one of those beaver gray sort of ABs. You can see that. And then we've got 453, 317. We've got three bags of 413 and a bag of 3024. And our last strip is the very small bags. We've got 352, 798, 743, 817, 351, 347. We've got a small bag of this carrot colored AB, which is 132. 
We've got 301, 803. We've got 107, which is like a 666 AB, I think. 239, 355, 700, 3836, 779, 3847, 783, 3727, 3835, and 645. All right. Okay, let's figure out where these ABs go. So the first one is that very small bag of that kind of cream colored AB. And uh, I just looked to see where this was because it's such a small amount and I was kind of surprised. So basically there's two little strips right here and that's where that goes. And then there are some lights, just a couple of little dots throughout the top up here and that's where they go. And then there's just a couple right here in the card in the Mad Hatter's hat. So interesting placement. I, okay, <laughs> okay. Um, and number two is 107, which is the red AB. It's got a lot of, a lot of gold reflection on there too. And number two is going to be, where did I just see that? Um, in the sleeves on the Queen of Hearts. She's got them just sort of scattered throughout the sleeves on her dress here. Um, let's see if there are any more. There are a couple in the scepter here and here. And I don't know if she's got any up here. Nope, there are not any up there. I don't see any in her lips either. I think maybe the scepter and the dress may be the only place because that was a very small bag too. It looks like there are just a couple here, um, right here in that dessert, I suppose. And um, are those twos? Nope, those are E's. And that's it. So, I mean, that was a pretty small bag as well. So mostly in um, the Queen of Hearts dress and scepter. Number three, we have 109. And that's kind of a unique color. Like I said, it's almost like a, I don't know, like between a tan and a gray. So I'm not sure what DMC that would be close to. That's number three, and that's the biggest bag we have. So let's figure out where that goes. All right, so once again, interesting color and interesting placement. We have some threes down in the leg and the, sort of the chest area of this little mouse. Um, we've got like two of them right here. We've got a section here and here in this uh, chair in that seat. We have some over here in the teapot um, and then there were a couple in this card up here and there are a couple in this card right here there were also some where did I find those um, in her teacup and down here just a touch in that teapot we've got some in this cup and a couple in this teapot and let me see if there's any in his hat over here. Yeah, there are just a couple in the card that's in the hat. And just a, a few right here on the side of the Cheshire cat. Just a couple throughout his, his teeth area right there. So that's where those go. So we've got this sort of carrot color. So that is going to be number four. All right, so another interesting placement, guys. We have a couple in the teapot here. We have some in the scepter. We've got some in these lighter areas of her crown. Then we've got, um, where else did I see this? Oh, it's really weird. It's in his hair, like right through here and in these lighter areas in his hair. Uh, and then I thought, ah. And then there were just a couple in this teapot, kind of in the, the flowers right there. 
So that all is all for number four. And then last but not least is number five. And this is our second largest bag, I think. So this is going to go all down in this area where the grass is light green, where you see this like lightest color green and all the sprigs of grass down there, you're gonna get number fives. You're also gonna get some throughout the teapot here. You're going to get a couple in the top part of that cake, like where it looks like little flower leaves. Um, you are going to get just a couple right here in this little cake and just a sprinkle through there. And that's gonna do it. So basically, I guess to kind of like even out where the ABs go, they're, they're putting all of the green down here since you've got so many spread out up there. So that is where all of the ABs go. All right, guys, so the What Lies Beneath and the Tea Party Canvas are the two that I was unboxing today. I hope that you like the unboxings. Please let me know your thoughts. Also, let me know how you guys feel about me showing you every single number, you know, going through all the drills. If you'd prefer me just to sort of show you the ABs and kind of do a little brief, you know, go through of the drills without saying each color, let me know that because I really want to do whatever uh, you guys like the most. I don't want to go through all the colors if it's not something that you care about. So anyways, um, I hope that you like this. Like I said, if you did, please consider giving me a thumbs up. And if you're not subscribed and you would like to see more from me, hit the subscribe button and click that bell and it will let you know anytime I put up a new video. All right, guys, until next time, I'll see you then. Bye.